dear children you are learning another topic of grammar class that are sentences types of sentences based on purpose and for 200 statement this you have already learned the three statement uh, that means declarative sentence interrogative sentence and the exclamatory sentences you have already learned the last one you wanted to learn that is imperative sentences and uh, the declarative sentences the which means it is a simple sentence it has negative sentence and positive sentence negative sentence add with the not and uh, how can we identify all these sentences declarative sentences we can identify easily with the at the end of the sentence we can see the full stop you just see we own a cat and the next one is interrogative sentence interrogative sentence that we are asking some questions and ends with a question mark and exclamatory sentence we have already learned that is a sudden expression and we have uh, ident we can identify it with ends with an exclamation mark the sentence ends with an exclamation mark and the last one is imperative sentences imperative sentence means it gives commands make request and ends with the periods or exclamation marks okay maybe it will be a full stop or an exclamation mark it will be there for imperative sentences let's know more about types of sentences it tells about something and ends with a full stop my dress is blue full stop interrogative sentence it asks something and ends with a question mark imperative sentence it tells something or someone to do and ends with a full stop iron my shirt for me please wipe the windows it may be a command or as an order or as a suggestion or for asking or request or help that is called imperative sentence we can identify with the this kinds of words and exclamatory sentences it expresses a strong feeling and uh, ends with an exclamation mark so so these are the four kinds of sentences declarative sentence make a statement interrogative sentence ask question imperative sentence gives command or makes a request it ends with a period and uh, shut the door see the example shut the door and exclamatory sentence expresses a strong feeling it ends with an exclamation mark so you have to identify that uh, a declarative sentence ends with a, it it will be a simple sentence imperative sentence we are asking some commands or request or something will be there okay so just go through some more examples declarative sentence a declarative sentence uh, have affirmative sentence and negative sentence that means positive sentence and a negative sentence i love my dog chemistry is my favorite subject but my brother really likes social studies they go to the gallery every sunday here we cannot see that any kind of command or request or something like suggestion like that so declarative sentence is a simple sentence that we are using you go to holiday every summer okay so now we can identify that another type of sentence that are an interrogative sentence interrogative contains and inter direct questions or interrogation uh, questions like what how which where when every question marks question words are called interrogative words and interrogative sentence ends with a question mark where do you live why have you st uh, started studying so these are called uh, interrogative sentence it uh, uh, normally we can identify with a question mark and uh, it have a question word also and uh, where do you live why have you started studying what kind of music do you want to dance which car would make you happier which do you prefer whom do you call and the next type of sentence is exclamatory sentence sentences contain surprise or emotion that means a sudden feeling how beautiful the city is sara wipe the board 
wow i miss that service don't talk get out and after each sentence after each sentence we are making an exclamation mark or we are putting an exclamation mark see how the way exclamatory sentence we wanted to write first of all the exclamatory word or something like that what or how we are using what a gorgeous room noun will be using then what a gorgeous room it is the verb will be at the last and we are ending with an exclamation mark how kind you are putting exclamation mark at the last and the verb will be last so these are the so you can solve uh, using exclamatory or writing exclamatory sentence what a beautiful girl you are what a lovely dog he has then we are putting the exclamation mark how pretty it is then types of sentences just of, uh, then we are on uh, once more we are learning that is declarative sentence interrogative sentence imperative sentence and a uh, exclamatory sentence declarative uh, sentence tells about something and ends with a full stop it will have positive and a negative sentences that means affirmative and a negative sentence interrogative sentence are something and ends with a question mark and imperative sentence tells someone to do something and ends with a full stop and exclamatory sentence expresses a strong feeling and ends with an exclamation mark i lost my wallet oh my god you are here just like that and now we are learning imperative sentences imperative sentences imperative sentences are the sentences that include commands in other words the imperative sentences are used to direct take a request instruction or an order a suggestion like that examples don't be afraid we are here fox show me some respect son stop the car immediately so this and all we can see that stop the car immediately it may be an order move your legs there would be a little pain so it's an instruction drive your car carefully if the wild wind blows this is also an instruction enjoy this delicious meal to install witcher 3 G game of the year edition download the steam desktop uh, launcher so there may be some kinds of request or a suggestion or an order something will be a command just like that so these kind of sentences are called uh, imperative sentence and ends with a full stop but it is not like that uh, declarative sentence declarative sentences are ends with a full stop but it has it is a simple sentence and it is a statement only but imperative sentences are commands request or instruction and we can see that kind of words also thank you have a great day